What's up everybody, this is Danny, and today I'm gonna show you something kinda cool for the LG G3. Now, when I bought mine in the United States, I did not get wireless charging built in, so I was a little bit disappointed by that. But what if I told you there was a really easy and cheap way to add wireless Qi charging or PMA charging to your G3? Well, I'm gonna show you that today, so let's go ahead and get started. So everything that I show you here in this video will be linked in the description section below if you want to check it out. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is check your backplate of your G3, and if you're in a different country, then this may vary, but here in the United States, you see there's only two pins at the top, that means that's just NFC. If you have four there, that means you may have wireless charging built in. So the very first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is actually take this off of your backplate. Now this is not the easiest thing to do, so you might have to use a heat gun or something like that. It's glued on there pretty good, but of course I already took this off prior to the video to say some time so you're gonna have to peel that off so be careful if you want to use this again but if you don't want to use it again then it's no problem whatsoever as I stated earlier in the video there are two different types the one on the right is the PMA charger so if you need that technology then that is also available but the one on the left is the Qi wireless chip and that's the one I'm gonna be using today because I have a lot of Qi wireless docks and bases so I'm gonna be installing that today the installation is pretty simple. You can see the cutout there where you removed it before, but you can't just stick it on there because this is a different size than the one that you took off before. So you're gonna have to kind of play with the connection here to see where it lies to get the best connection. So you may have to make a few marks on the back of the back plate for you to get it on there correctly. But the easiest way for me was that I took some scotch tape and I kind of played with the position of it and put the back plate on and pretty much tested to see if the wireless charging works or not. And I found that to be the easiest way to get this thing to work. And once you actually get it to align up correctly, then make some marks on there and we're gonna stick on that back receiver chip. So it took me a couple of tries to get it lined up exactly the way it wanted to be to do the wireless charging. I noticed that you have to shift it a little bit to the left, at least on my model, and it doesn't fit exactly to that contour of the old chip. After you know that position is right and it is wireless charging, then go ahead and take this back sticker off of there. This is pretty sticky, so be careful putting it on there. But what I did was I made a few marks right there. As I told you before, it is a little bit shifted to the left there, and all you have to do is put a little bit of pressure on there, and it sticks just fine to that back plate. Then all you have to do is put the back cover back on. But if you don't wanna go through all of this trouble, then they do make a back plate that is replaceable that already has this wireless chip in there. And I'll also leave that in the description section below if you just wanna buy it as a replaceable back plate. You can use any Qi wireless charging dock that you want to and it'll work just fine with this chip. You might have seen this one before in my how to add wireless charging to your iPhone 6 and 6 Plus video. If you haven't seen that already, make sure you check that out. So what do you guys think? Pretty easy, right? It's about 10 bucks. I think it's pretty easy installation. If you wanna buy that back charging plate with it already installed, it's a little bit more. So make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one.